गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन वेलकम टू ऑल इन दिस लेक्चर नंबर ट्वेंटी सिक्स ऑफ मॉड्यूल फोर सो बेसिकली इन दिस लेक्चर वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट सिस्टम ऑफ जस्टिस सो वी विल डिस्कस सिस्टम ऑफ जस्टिस एंड वी विल ऑल्सो फोकस ऑन द प्रॉब्लम्स ड्यू टू लैक ऑफ दिस एबसेंस ऑफ जस्टिस एंड देन वी विल फाइंड आउट द अप्रोप्रिएट सोल्यूशंस so the justice can be ensured again so with this let's start the lecture so first we will talk about the goal of this system of justice so let's study what is the goal of system of justice so number 1 every human being should be able to do justice this is a primary goal of a judicial system a system of justice so main role of this system of system of justice is to ensure ability to live with justice in everyone or ensure justice at all four levels of living this should be the goal of a judicial system this should be the goal of a system of justice and we talked about in previous lecture 2 what is the meaning of ensuring justice mutual fulfillment it means recognition of the relationship fulfillment of values evaluation of those values and leading to mutual happiness so we studied in the previous lecture in detail about the meaning of justice so let's find out this system of justice and problem due to absence of this justice and its solution so problems and solution in the absence of justice so everyone tries to develop ability in child so that child can live in a mutually fulfilling manner a manner but somehow if the child is not able to ensure this competence to live with justice in this whole process of education then it gives rise to many problems in the society so somehow if the child is not able to develop this competence to live with justice in this the process of education then it gives to many problems in the society so somehow if it is missed the child is not able to live in relationship the child feels aggressive in themselves so as a solution there are two main points number 1 how to develop this ability in those who do not have the ability to do justice somehow it is slipped from family somehow it is slipped from the education system so first point is how to develop that ability second is how to stop the injustice that is currently happening in the absence of this competence of fulfillment of justice so two steps are required one is to ensure the ability to do justice and second is to stop this injustice so the first point is to reform a reform is required so that those who are somehow not able to ensure justice may understand this justice and live accordingly second is to punish and reform so we are going to discuss both of these points so let's start with reform and punishment the only possibility for the first point is to reform and you can sense that reform is a long term program and it is required a right education right education sanskars if the person somehow has not gone through this right kind of education then this ability of do justice has not been developed by imparting this education then this program should be run for him so somehow if it is not ensured then the whole program of ensuring this justice through the process of exploration through the process of investigation is required for those people 
so this is the reform program and there are two possibilities for the second point the first is reform and second is punishment to punish when there is a no way to prevent justice at least to stop that person temporarily or the social damage that is being done by that person so it is required to punish that person but it is not only the step it is also required to have a program to reform along with punishment so only punishment will not work do not work a process of reform along with this punishment is required so punishment is just to stop that person so that he may not be able to damage more in the society but stopping them through punishment is not enough along with this punishment a process of reform is also required if this process does not happen if there is no reform process then that person may create many problems so the process of reform with punishment is required you can sense it through a simple example suppose there is your child and your child does some mistake so two things would be required one is to stop him immediately and second is to work on the right understanding of the child so that in future he may understand the right and wrong so both are required so reform along with the process of punishment is required but process of reform is must if you see the current state of judiciary so the main goal of the judicial system is to ensure justice in the society so it is very natural why this judiciary system exist in society definitely one of the main goals is to ensure justice everywhere in the society and for this what has to be done for this there is a need to ensure the development of the competence in the people to do justice through the process of education where we can facilitate the process of self exploration process of self investigation we can make them aware through the process of education about the self about the values all this is responsibility of this judiciary system but if you see presently the judiciary system is not focusing on either of the two what judiciary system is doing today is active where injustice take place so judiciary system works only when injustice take place that's why this program is not enough to ensure justice in the society so this role has to be ensured by the judiciary system so until we do not ensure this role of judiciary system the mis happening in the society due to inhuman behavior will be continue so what would be effective ways of ensuring justice so ensure that every person is able to do justice we have to work for education system we have to work for a humane education system we need a education that may help a child to develop the competence for doing justice this kind of education system is required so if the person is not able to do justice even after undergoing this kind of education due to his own strong sanskars so there is a need to support them through the reform education which may provide special attention in the area of deficiencies 
presently if the person is doing injustice in society then he may be punished to act as a deterrent in the society but we need to pass in through the process of reform simultaneously so only punishment is not enough to ensure harmony in the society so with this punishment a process of reform is required so judiciary system has to focus on these two aspects too to ensure the harmony in the society so problems caused due to lack of justice there are many visible problems which exist due to this lack of justice and the process of reform is an important step to revive the justice in all those people who are somehow not able to ensure human behavior in his interaction so the main issue in justice is to live with fulfillment in relationship so when we are unable to live in this manner temporarily we can find out some way as a remedy but that should not be considered as justice so if we are looking for temporary solution if we are only trying to punish the people it may stop injustice temporarily but in future it will create many problems so stopping it is useful but not moving towards the reform education will create many problems in future so it is important to note that due to absence of feeling of relationship we keep quarreling over small issues of physical facility so it has to be cleared it should be noted that injustice is because of the lack of fulfillment of this feeling of relationship so if justice has to ensure the work has to be done on ensuring this feeling of relationship in everyone otherwise people keep quarreling on a very small issues that you can see in the prevalent societies people fight for few rupees people murder others for few rupees people are killing killing each other for the properties disputes all it is all these are happening because of the absence of this feeling of relationship so through this reform education we can ensure this feeling of relationship in the child so to resolve this issue of relationship improvement is required in the sanskars so the issue is basically the behavioral issue is because of the sanskars and this improvement of sanskar is required essential improvement in feeling and thoughts is essential ensuring resolution at the level of self is essential so it is better to do this through formal education itself so it should be addressed at the level of formal education informal education at the level of policy through reform education so that the ability to ensure justice in everyone may be ensured and this reform is possible only through the process of relationship and affection it is very important point if the focus is to ensure feeling of relationship in the other then it can only be happen with the feeling of affection and relationship so improvement in sanskar cannot happen with fear so punishment is not the real remedy so by punishing someone the other may stop their tendency for temporarily but if we want to ensure resolution in the other then the feeling of relationship affection is required 
so we try to stop a man committing crime from outside and if he does not change himself internally then he either tries to find out suitable conditions or try to create such conditions so the issue is the sanskar so if we are not trying to improve the other sanskar he will try to find out many ways to do corruption to do unethical things so it can be stopped temporarily through various process but in long term this education of reform is required so the agency system of reform must for present day judiciary so as i discussed without this kind of education a person cannot change himself if we are not doing anything at this point then the person may become angry may become aggressive or try to find out ways to take revenge and so many things that's why this system of reform must be present in our judiciary system secondly the family member should be encouraged to support that person to give them a good environment who has good behavior who has in human behavior so through with the education process with the reform education their parents their family members should be encouraged so that a proper a conducive environment can be provided to that person so for that the family member should be asked that they should help them and give him compatible condition that support is strengthening that desire 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 developed during the reform process so once a human being goes through this kind of reform process a conducive environment is required to sustain those sanskars those upgraded sanskar and in this the family members can help them through providing a conducive environment for that person if we do not ensure these things there are many kind of disputes exist in our society and most of the disputes are among the brothers or the members of the same family and it is happening because of the lack of feelings in relationship so most of the disputes may be sorted out if we start seeing relationship and responsibility towards each other so that's why focusing on this feeling of relationship focusing on the ability to develop coexistence with other is an important step that is required from judiciary system so judiciary system must find out a ways <coughs> to ensure this feeling of relationship in everyone so system of justice if we see at present there are many problems of the present judiciary system as you know people waits for many years to get justice and during this period the false witnesses are produced false medical reports are made also there is a corruption at the level of judge and police department etc so all this is happening in the present system but what is the right solution the solution is to develop the ability to see the relationship with others only with the feeling of relationship only with the feeling of affection the qualitative growth in the sanskar can be done so some provisions for improvement give importance to gram panchayat village court so that many disputes are resolved at the level of this gram panchayat there is a need for counseling sessions meditation process before the trial in the court of law 
द मैटर कैन बी रिजॉल्व बाई मेकिंग अ पर्सन हु आर नॉट कनेक्टेड विद एनी प्रॉपर पर्सन कंसेप्ट ऑफ ओपन जेल कैन बी इंड्यूस्ड वेयर द पर्सन मे लिव विथ देयर फैमिली मेम्बर्स ऑल दीज काइंड ऑफ स्टेप्स should be included in our judiciary system so you take pause you can find out out more steps you can give more creative ideas what kind of provision should be included in our judiciary system so that a victim may improve his or her sanskar <clears throat> so what is to be done at the level of family at the level of society at the level of policy to ensure this justice in the society so healthy dialogue is needed at all the three levels at the level of family family clusters villages so uh, there is a need to create an environment where fam a healthy dialogue can be done at the level of family within the group of family so we can find out a time we can make a schedule in a week where each and every member of family can discuss their issues with each other so there we dis- should be discussion on positive issues in that meeting what is required what has done wrong rather than focusing on this issue the focus should be on what is required so if we work on what is required what feelings are required to be free from Pro- all these complaints then this meetings can be held purposefully and goal of the system is to have the minimum requirement of professions like police judge and lawyers and what would be the contribution of those professions simply the purpose of those professions would be to support the family the village the village clusters in organizing this meeting work as a mediator to monitor whether the feeling of justice is being ensured or not all this can be done through these professional bodies so that's all from my side friends thank you very much let's meet in the next lecture Thank you very much. Have a good day.